Suicide Awareness Month is in September, but as we know, it's a year-round problem. Tonight, we introduce you to UA Little Rock basketball player who opens up about her battles with suicide. Our Gary Burton Jr. joins us live from the Jack Stevens Center in Little Rock tonight. And Gary, she is known for her strength on the court, but what she's overcome in life, it is simply inspirational. Inspirational to say the least. When you take a look at number 34 for the Lady Trojans, just from her physical appearance, you'd never be able to guess all the things that she's been through in life, including multiple attempts of suicide. But thankfully, she found the sport of basketball that she says saved her life. It took years for senior UA Little Rock basketball player Angelique Francis to learn. No matter how dark the tunnel seems, there's a light at the end of it. As a child, she was a very successful golfer, along with being physically and mentally abused by an authority figure who she chooses not to identify. I was getting hit on, beat on, um, hit with my golf clubs. I've gotten a golf ball thrown at my head before. It happened so much that it became a norm. I just thought that that was how you should be treated. She eventually moved to a new loving home with her mother and stepfather, away from her abuser. But because she said pain is all she knew, she started to self-harm. I started cutting, burning. It's hard now to think about all the things that have, you know, gone on or happened and how I've been able to survive it. At one point, her arm was lashed with 32 cuts. And in all, Francis says she survived eight suicide attempts. Part of the reason she survived was basketball. To go from a sport that's individual to um, a sport where you can throw people down, um, being able to be competitive, have family or girls next to you to work as a team. Her organization, ALF, is another reason she chooses life. I started an organization that helps with uh, mental health awareness, um, suicide prevention, homelessness. 20% of all donations and funds made from clothing sales go to charities to benefit these areas. Everything that I've been through, I've, you know, I've asked God, like, what is my purpose on being here? The answer to that question isn't snagging rebounds and scoring points to put banners in the gym. It's to tell her story so that others suffering can see the day to tell theirs. No matter what I go through, I will always keep pushing forwards. And Angelique is also a motivational speaker. Multiple times in the past few years, she spoke at the state capitol representing UA Little Rock at the Arkansas Students Rise Above Alcohol and Drug Rally. Now, if you would like to donate or purchase some items um, from her organization, ALF, we'll have that information on our website, krk.com. Live in Little Rock, I'm Gary Burton, Jr. Back to you.